This video is brought to you by BossRootin.com. Fight me, a fearless expression. What are you willing to fight for? And PowerPerformanceProducts.com, where you can receive $10 off your purchase of Body Storm and Body Effects. He's, you know, he's not a super specialist in any area, but his experience in caginess, you know, can allow him to capitalize when someone makes a mistake, and he, due to his experience, he's not going to fade, and that can be the most dangerous type of opponent. So, uh, you know, I've only had 15 fights. I still have a lot to work on, but, uh, you know, winning's winning. Was there a particular kind of attack you wanted? Did you, were you looking for the back? Were you looking for maybe... The, you passed his guard quite a bit, but not really moved to London that much. What were you looking for? Uh, I wanted to make it more of a wrestling match. Um, you know, with that being said, that may not be the most uh, fan-friendly type of fight in general, but uh, once you stop taking your strengths to your opponent's weaknesses, you're no longer an intelligent MMA fighter. So uh, I tried to stay active on the ground. I wished uh, round two and three would have looked more like one. Um, but, uh, you know, he's tough. They don't always go as planned. I tried to be ready for three rounds, uh, but uh, the goal is just to keep getting better and better. Were you surprised that you weren't able to go for more submission attempts in that fight? Um, it wasn't so much to go for more submission attempts, but after I get the takedown, to not let him get back up. Uh, let that happen in the, in the second and third round. So uh, i just like to work on my, uh, my stabilization on top a little bit more and uh, even further more aggressive with the ground and pound. Why was George holding your shorts open there? Is that just to let you breathe more? I was just curious. <laughs> I actually don't remember that. Uh, but. Uh, I would think it would be just for uh, for air. <laughs> was was Alessio as strong as you anticipated when you locked up with him? More or less, yes. But I I, I figured that uh, wrestling would be his weakest point, and he seemed from from his past tape, it seemed like uh, uh, defensive wrestling scrambles uh, seemed to make him most tired. So uh, I, I'm usually pretty good at grinding people. So I tried to uh, I tried to make it more of a wrestling type of match because I knew he would start to slow down a little bit before me and I could kind of feel it when I would get the takedown that's uh, that's clearly where he wasn't as efficient and wasted most energy. Do you feel like you deserve a guy in the top 10 next? Yeah absolutely uh, you know the the goal is to keep fighting tough opponents uh, you know uh, John's a different type of opponent than Matt Wyman he has more experience overall but not in the UFC but uh, you know he, I, I guess equally as tough but uh, got to be ready for whoever. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, I've, I've never got in this to lose fights, but uh, you know, you, you fight the best guys in the world. In the world, you you know, you're gonna lose sooner or later. Um, it was never easy, but the main goal was to just uh, keep learning and growing. I only have 15 fights, so you know, I've had hundreds of jujitsu matches, so it, it still takes a bit and. Coming from the grappling background, it takes uh, it, it takes time to learn striking, but uh, you know, slowly but surely. When's that? Uh, so with, uh, with three Canadian events going up, I'm guessing the uh, hope would be that you'd be on one of those cards. Yeah, I'd ab absolutely like to be on uh, on the on the later ones, but it was a it was a tough camp, tough fight, so uh, def body definitely needs to unplug a little bit. But uh, yeah, Montreal or Toronto would be fantastic. Is the striking clearly the, the area that you want to work on the most? Or do you still spend more time improving your, your grappling, keep your grappling great? Well, you, you, can't, you can't forget your strengths. You can't forget what got you there. Um, you know, but with certain type of opponents, you need to show some versatility. Uh, the idea in this particular fight was to, uh, to make it more of a wrestling match, because that's where he seemed to, f to fade and have the most trouble in his previous fights that I studied, his more recent fights. But, uh, you know, I definitely have to keep working on my striking, no question, and uh, just, you know, be as, uh, as well-rounded as I can, have as many tools as I can. Godspeed and party on.